What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Yella. <clears throat> my apologies for my my voice. <clears throat> Battling a cold right now, but I wanted to hit you guys with a quick video. Yeah, I'm using toilet paper to wipe my nose. And I don't feel like going to get a box of Kleenex. <laughs> but anyway, um, I just uh, picked up a couple items from the Apple store today. No, these aren't the items. These are actually the items that I'm selling. I'm getting rid of this iPad Pro. This is the 10.5 inch. I'm kind of downgrading a little bit. And the reason that I'm downgrading is because Apple decided to bring back one of my favorite items of all time, which is the iPad mini. All right. So <clears throat> if you're new to my channel, you probably don't know that one of my very first devices that I reviewed was the iPad mini, the original, that my wife got me for Christmas one year. This was some years ago. That was the original iPad mini. Um, it's still in the family. Actually, I gave it to my daughter a few years ago, but I just uh, upgraded her this past Christmas with the, the iPad 2018. But we still have the iPad mini just sitting around. But I did miss the form factor of the iPad Mini. They hadn't uh, refreshed it in almost four years. And lo and behold, they finally refreshed it. And I decided to pick it up. Now, the reason that I was okay with downgrading is because I actually have an iPhone and I have a MacBook. So a good in-between device to me or a perfect in-between device is the iPad mini. So it doesn't cannibalize either the iPhone nor the um, the MacBook. So to me, it's a great in-between device, very uh, portable, very powerful. I love that they updated the chip. So with the A12 Bionic chip, um, more powerful than the Fusion chip that I had in the iPad Pro, even though um, I'm assuming that there's more cores on the a10 fusion x chip that's in the ipad pro i just don't think i'm going to see a real world difference the way i use it i only play a couple different games so i don't really think i'll miss the extra uh graphic graphical power all right but i did pick up the mini i also picked up just a little um uh, case to go with it which is just the um uh, smart cover so i want to keep it nice and thin uh, unlike what I did for the, the Pro, where I had this uh, more of a protective case. But since the Mini is so small, I just figure keeping just a little smart case on it is going to be fine. Um, I went with the cellular model. Um, the six or 64 gig Wi-Fi and cellular model. Uh, I debated for a little bit on whether or not if I needed the, um, the 256. I really think that'd be overkill, uh, especially um, when I can just save things with the MacBook Pro and other just um, iCloud services. So uh, hit me up in the comments. Let me know if you guys are going to pick up an iPad mini. Did you already pick one up? How do you like it? And uh, if there's anything you guys want to see, any games or anything like that running on the mini. But again, I just, I just figured a great in-between device. <clears throat> A great in-between device. To me, the iPad cannot replace a laptop. So I'm not even trying to replace a laptop. I just need a device to be in between. A nice travel device, something I can play games on. A lot of media consumption. I think this is uh, the right way to go. So if you guys think I'm crazy or if you uh, agree, disagree, hit me up in the comments, let me know. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next video. It's your boy Yellow, I'm out. Peace.